way. Barack Obama gave a speech today in Israel about peace. And the news people are already calling it the best ever. They're always saying it's the, um, you know, it's probably the most effective speech on peace. So I'm telling you, watch this news reel. And look at the okay. date. It's getting near the Illuminati 322 date. Watch what happens. So, some stuff's going to get ready to happen. Jesus is going to come back. Y'all better put on your seatbelt unless you're saved. Obama just gave a big speech on peace in the Middle East in Jerusalem. I'm telling now the news is saying, uh, Wolf Blitzer on CNN said, That's the greatest peace speech in the history of presidential peace speeches on the Mideast. I'm telling you, here's the Antichrist. Is now going to work to make peace really possible. Peace uh, in Israel. Where, where do the, the uh, Israelis and the Palestinians and the United States and others in the international community go from here? Uh, let's bring in Dr. Hanan. Antichrist. 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 Executive Committee, a member of the Palestinian Legislative Council. Uh, Dr. Esrawi, what did you think of what the president had to say? Well, I do think that this was the most comprehensive speech we have heard. Uh, it has the same basic components, but on the one hand, it has a very key He looks like an alien. <laughs> and an American president with such a strong commitment to the Zionist ideology. Oh my God, it's weird. And to an understanding of I'm not doing any camera and tricks. And He's an alien. Look, it's coming so through. He's a gray. I'm changing the frequency the on him. Uh, with the Israeli public, and uh, he did go over the head of the leader. Look at him! Oh my god! And he tried to reach to the young generation, to the Israeli public, to tell them that they have to influence their He leadership. looks like a fucking grey, dude. Had Look to at him. That. He had to tell them he guaranteed their security, he guaranteed their future. This is it. He's going to broker the seven-year peace accord. He's an alien. Look at him. He's the Antichrist. Look how he's coming through on my camera. It's crazy. I swear there's no effects on it. When I pull back, watch. Look. That's only what your eye sees in the visible spectrum. But the camera somehow catches his real likeness. Look. See how I twist the camera? Nerve heads didn't do that. Look, he's a fucking alien. It's possible, it's viable, or tenable, no continued occupation, no expulsion of Palestinians is possible, and the continued impunity of the Israeli settlers and so on. Antichrist! Antichrist! to have a, a strong, a viable, independent Palestinian state. Now, the interesting factor was... They divide Jerusalem. That's when God's hand, or foot, hits the olives, Mount of Olives. To the fact that the occupation cannot continue, to the fact Look how he looks like an alien. Oh, my God, look at his, his elongated head. Holy shit, Wow. Oh my God! Look at him. He's an Anunnaki. He's a gray. Watch when they if they show anybody else. Their heads didn't do anything. Oh yeah. <laughs> He's an alien too. Holy heaven! Look at him. He's a straight alien. Dude. Oh my loving heaven! Look at that. Story. Okay. See the mayor of New York, Michael now see, their heads aren't doing it. The uh, vice president of the United States. See? Oh my God! Their heads weren't doing it. Representatives, family members from Newtown, Connecticut, look. on the sensitive issue of. Oh my God! Look, they don't all look alien. Right now to the mayor. Look, they look real. To be with us today, I appreciate your courage, and I think you. See, he don't look uh, cracked out. Has to do something. These guys are real. Look at them. He's an alien. Look at his head. Got big. His head ain't getting big. Shit. Shit. We have to pull together here and stop this carnage. There is a I don't know, man. I don't know. 
And the lesson is, if we ignore the horrors of the past, we are doomed to repeat them. That's right. So if we let the uh, government have our guns, then, uh, oh, like history's past, we'll get lined up, sent to camps, and fucking shot in the back of the head. So you remember that fucking douchebag bird. Look at all those criminals standing up there. It's ever the dude on the right. He's just a, a plant. Blah, blah, blah. Anyway, you saw that, man. Barack Obama is the Antichrist. 